When I was nine, mum and me used to live with dad. But we had to move because dad was so angry all the time. He would go crazy and push mum around and sometimes hit her and me. Mum said dad had a violent streak and that his childhood was not very good and that's what made him so angry. I remember being scared and sometimes I would hide with mum in the bathroom when he was really violent. I pretended that I was playing footy for the Tigers and that I kicked lots of goals. It made the screaming go away. One day after school, mum and I just left and moved out. It was really hard. Dad had screamed at mum that he would finish her and me if she tried to leave. He told me to stop sticking up for her and to get a brain or he would sort me out. I don't know why he said that stuff. After we left, I used to get into a fair bit of trouble at school. I didn't have any friends that liked me and the teachers didn't like me either. Mum used to get upset with me about it all because I got suspended from school a bit for fighting. A little while after we left home and moved into a new place, Mum took me to meet with Karen. Karen was so nice, she was like a counsellor. I remember I used to hate it and I didn't really want to go there. After a while, Karen helped me with some breathing stuff and we used to hang out a bit. Karen was really good with his stories and I got to draw a lot, which I like. After about a year, I wasn't so angry all the time. Before I met Karen, I used to believe what Dad said to me that I was a waste of space. And he used to blame me for why Mum and him had so many fights. I didn't know why I was feeling so jumbled up, but Karen said that it wasn't my fault. Dad was just violent to me and Mum. Karen was really nice and I felt better around her. She helped Mum too. Mum was always sad, but she said Karen was like a rock and a good soul. I think that she really helped us in a hard time. I don't think I would have had so many friends if I'd kept being that angry. I don't really think children should feel like that. The Australian Childhood Foundation is committed to helping children like Jonas, who are affected by family violence and abuse. We help to change the stories that these children tell themselves. We give them a chance to build relationships that support a safe childhood beyond the trauma that has defined their lives. We need your support to help these children know there is a community around them who will stand up for them. Our work changes children's stories of violation into stories of hope. Your generous gift will help kids like Jonas. To donate, visit www.childhood.org.au.